Well, I've been working on this, as you can see. It goes together quite well. I think what I'll do is actually not put holes for the balls in the back side, in a way, which is the front. The balls come in from the back in, in this side. So it'll be in the front part. I will not put holes for the balls to go in. Then it gives you a chance to line it up, drill through 2.5 and put a three millimetre ball in bolt and that will give a chance for the balls to line up because even a slight bit out I found that um, it's a little bit dubious shall we say yes the draw goes in that's how we want the draw we want this part to overlap the bottom bottom edge of the draw there so any moisture going down Almost every go in the draw, you can also put your fingers in like this. Although they tend to get stuck a bit. Now, one thing about PLA is it is I've done a test on this, filled this full of water, and it does either absorb it all or it disappears if you like. It does leak, and that's pretty well. I think it's 30% infill, if I remember right. The idea there is the moisture catches, falls down into the drawer and then you can empty it, put another one in. But what I want to talk about is the fan that I've got and this lag. So there's four 40mm uh, heat sinks and you can see that the, I tried super gluing them together and a bit of this heat sink sort of cement. And they haven't glued very well. I've also tried gluing these washers on here with some glue. And they haven't glued very well. So this does fit, it does fit in the unit. I've done a test and I've used, I haven't, I've lost my Peltier crystal, believe it or not, my Peltier chip. So this would, imagine that's a Peltier chip, this would sort of go on there with some heat sink paste. And this on here making sure the slots are in the right way so that's the cold side to catch any moisture whoops any moisture and that's the hot side it'll take the heat away with this big heat sink with the fan on now I've had a problem with when I tested this with the fan it's almost like it does it blows um, which I wanted, I wanted it to blow that way because that, that's the back where the fan is blow out that way but it, all, it almost blows inwards for some reason now I know this does turn this way when I've done a test on it it does turn the correct way to blow outwards you can see that these are almost going to screw the air outwards or should do like this way but the air seems to be going this way. I've done a smoke test on a piece of plastic bag over there and it almost gets sucked in. Now, one thing I forgot to do, I can't remember when I ordered this, is this thing called high static pressure, which is for things like radiators and things like that. This is not, so far as I can tell, a high static pressure. So I can pull that apart. I mean, it is stuck reasonably well with that glow so obviously the wrong type of glow there but if you look at fan blades there's a there's almost a gap there which air can leak through but if you look at a high static pressure one the, the, it's almost like the fan blades almost overlap like that so any air finds it very hard to like back th flow through the fan so in a way that's the wrong type of fan um, I think it would still work to be honest with you. So that's just a little bit about this. I'll have to find a better way of sticking these together. So that would go well on the four heat sinks. And this, as I say, this does fit in the unit. I've tried it. I'd go like that. Peltier, I've, I've done a piece of cardboard because that's about the thickness of the Peltier. Sorry, this is going out. That'll be about the thickness of a Peltier cell. And then heat sink on there. Well, the, uh, the 
call side on, so the call side would be this side to cool the air and get the moisture out and then would drip down and hopefully drip down into the tray. Uh, I think I've got to find some better glue. I tried super glue and this heat cement, not heat sink paste, heat cement it was. And as you see it's fallen apart and that other super strong glue. Well, it's not glued it all that strong. So that's just an update. I'm going to have to think about... Uh, well, what, what I'm going to do about all of this. I think that's a good model. A hole in the side for the wires to come out. Grill for the fan to blow air out. Very hard keeping this in the camera, to be honest with you. Yep. And a drawer to catch the water. What's this? Is that stuck? That's reasonably strong, that one. That's reasonably strong, so it's just these two parts together. So maybe I need more super glue on it rather than cement because each one can act independently of each other to a certain extent. Anyway, I'll do an experiment with that. I think I'll get a different fan, one with higher static pressure this is 80 millimeter fan well I've put some super glue on and now that's I mean I can put that under a bit of pressure I don't want to put it under too much pressure because it probably will come apart but that's strong you probably see some of the super glue on here I tried to put on the edge I mean that will basically sand off I have been sanding this earlier you probably see the scratch marks on that's strong with super glue, so that like heat sink cement, not heat sink paste, heat sink cement I was using is obviously not too good. It might absorb the heat, help the heat go, but it doesn't help stick so far as I can tell. And I've tried it on some other chips with heat sinks on, and it's not done very good. So, yeah, just super glue. Now, I've still got to. See about getting a high static pressure fan, I think. That will blow a bit harder, so to speak. Yep, so just using super glue on the four 40 millimeters, so 40 millimeters, 40 millimeters, 80 millimeters, 80 millimeters that way. Always remember when you're doing this to put the fins the right way around because any moisture going in either side, it'd be moist. this will be the warm side, it's a bit unlikely, but certainly the cold side, moisture going in, want the fins facing downwards, so that moisture will run down, if you put them that way, then moisture is going to get trapped in the, in the blades there, 